Could it be some apple brew? Move over. Make room for your new friend. It's a bit late to start cooking food. <sighs> Did you think about the fact that this might be our last night and that we just spent it getting hot top on apple brew? Why would it be our last I don't know. You can never know. Tomorrow, another batch of hornets might show up. <laughs> We'll kick their butt. <laughs> yes, but at the same time, maybe not. Seriously, though, don't you think about it? Yeah, often. And? And what? Well, what'd you say? I mean, what would you do if you knew that this was our last night on Source. Let's say our last day. I'll give you that. Do you want me to show you what I would do? <laughs> okay, I know. That's also the first thing that crossed my mind. But we can't do that for 24 hours straight. We need to take breaks. So, besides that, what would you do? That's a real question. Do I have time to think about it? Yeah, sure. Take your time. Mm, I think that... I would stare at the stars. Oh yeah? I would locate the apiary planets with a telescope, and I would show them my butt. Serious. Seriously? Same answer. As both a way to escape, and to look danger in the face. Infinite space, and in the middle of it all, the prison in which they want to keep us. I kind of like those contradictions. Oh no. I was thinking about a thing, but it will sound lame in comparison. <laughs> yeah. You're always coming up with poetic stuff. Mine's just dumb. Just say... I would take a stroll. A stroll? I told you it was like, but in the end, I think that's what I would miss most about so Sliding around with you, hand in hand. Discovering new places, or even just here, around the nest. Hopping on aerial flow threads, picking up apple doozes, what we usually do, I guess. I think that's what I would miss the most. The usual. Okay, I'll change my answer. Forget about the stars. I'd rather go on a stroll with you. Note that we could do both. You know what else we'd have time for? A creamberry fondue. Of course. Of course is in, of course I would say that. Or of course, we'll have a creamberry fondue. Both. But we don't have to wait until our last day on Source to... No. 
but not tonight. Too tired. Do you want to go lay down? No, thanks. I'm good right here. <laughs> Oh, and we have... And then, we'll need to double-check that there is, in fact, a communications post on Lanaro. Aha! Uh -huh. We didn't know what to do. And now, we have too many things to do. Ooh, what's that smell? Could it be... Some apple brew? Put it 
the six. Yeah, often. Well, what'd you say? Let's. Yeah. I think that I would look and I'm serious. Same as both. Of what would? Oh, just. I told you, but slap discovering new places or what were you? you know what else we'd have time for? A creamberry fondue. Uh, but no, like a yes. No. <laughs> Lights off? Yeah. Maybe the hornets will have a harder time finding us in the dark. That's not funny. I wasn't trying to be funny. I'm sorry to be a downer, but I can't stop thinking about what they would do if they caught us. The hornet? No. The hornets will just neutralize. I meant the apiary. They'll split us apart. Match us with our respective mates. And how will they achieve that? By force? Have you ever seen anyone fight back during their matching ceremony? We can't be the only ones who refused our mates, can we? What do you mean? Have you ever heard about recalibrating? Oh no, not this old wives' tale about brainwashing. I never said it was brainwashing, just erasing selected bits of memory. Do you really believe in that stuff? Why not? It's technically possible. I mean, it is conceivable. Don't they erase some memories in drama therapy? Why wouldn't the council apply that to other uses? Such as? Well, for instance, they could erase the memories we have of each other. That way, we'd be a lot more amenable to the matchmaking. <sighs> in drama therapy, they erase very specific, very short memories. Of I don't think you could erase all of the memories of one person that way. That would erase entire years in a person's life. Do you think that we are technically unable to, or morally unwilling to? Uh, I was trying to get some sleep, you. Well, too bad. There's no reason I should be the only sleepless one. But it does taste great. Did you find it? You'll have to hold on a little. Up. I still think that I could. Sure. No. I was. Th Good thinking. What is all that junk up there? Keep in mind, I got the nest when I was 16. I've had a lot of time to accumulate stuff. 
16, you say? Any chance we'll find some anime posters and nudie mags? <laughs> if that's the most compromising thing you can think of, you're severely lacking imagination. <laughs> I got it! You can put me down. So? Give it to me! Oh no! I will let you see my diary, because I- But first, I have to check that there's nothing embarrassing. It's a diary. Nothing t Oh no, not today. I am not ready. to fix up the nest, Iron. We just need a procedure uh, for it. Oh, and we haven't even mapped the end. And then... Aha! Uh -huh. We didn't know what to do. And As if I feel sleepy right now.
up here. Yeah, we should have packed you a little sweater. 